Three days after spawning our Chinese catfish eggs, the uh, eggs hatched and these beautiful little baby fry emerged. At this stage, they're barely able to swim. Their stomach is really just a large yolk sac. But they do, uh, they do swim well enough to clump up into these really large, uh, large masses. And they're looking really healthy. Now at this stage, it's critically important to keep the tanks clean. So every morning, we have to siphon out most of the water. And to do that, we, uh, we use a fish net in front of the siphon to exclude the baby fry, because they, they swim well enough to get into trouble, and they tend to get sucked up. We don't want to lose them. We also find it helps to tap on the side a little bit just to kind of scare them away from the, from the siphon. And then uh, when the water is low enough, we use a turkey baster to suck up uh, as much of the fish waste and the excess food uh, as possible. And in, uh, invariably, a couple of little fry get sucked up here and there. It takes a real steady hand, but with patience and, and time, you can, you can get them out. And we, um, we squirt the water from the turkey baster into a plastic bucket so that if we did make a mistake, we can still you know, get the fry back be, before the water is thrown away completely. And just two months after, after all of that, um, the little fry or fingerlings now are ready to move into these little plastic kiddie pools. They're about an inch, inch and a half long at this point. They're feeding very well, and they're gulping air already, so we don't need to have aeration in the pool. Uh, they've just been moved in here, so this water will very soon turn green with algae, which will help feed them as well and, uh, and take up all their waste and so forth. As you can see, they're, starting, they're still clumping here, uh, and they're looking really healthy. They're very vigorous, very active, and uh, just beautiful little fish. We still have uh, some other fish, another uh, 1,000 or 2,000 uh, catfish that are a little bit older, about two months older. They're well ahead of the game. These guys are four to five inches long at this point. We'll keep them in green water for several months, uh, grow them up to close to market size, and then we'll transfer them to one of our big aquaponics tanks uh, where they'll be in really clean water for the last few months to turn them into just absolutely delicious table fish. They're very healthy little fish.